Hello everyone and welcome to MBAP. CMAT 2021 exam is done, but it has created a lot of mess, a lot of chaos among students, especially from slot two, because of two main reasons. One is the wrong questions. Second is in some cases, students did not get the extra time for the new section, which they were supposed to get. Now, the point is this, that if at all you have faced these problems in your CMAT paper, how are you going to raise objections? Okay, are you going to get the grace marks for those questions or not? I'm going to discuss all of that in this video till the very end. Okay, I'm going to solve all, uh, you know, show you all the possible steps that you should be taking. So make sure that you watch this video till the end, share it with your friends, like our content so that you can read, you can see more and more updates from our side on a regular basis. A quick reminder to subscribe to our channel before I go ahead and also follow us on Instagram for regular updates. Now, the point is, if you see with regards to the wrong questions, what exactly happened? Okay, let me show some light. Okay, throw some light on that. In slot number two, approximately four to five questions, okay, has come wrong. Okay, some people are saying five, six, some people are saying two to three questions. But this is for sure that people have got wrong questions in their slot, okay, especially slot number two. In slot number one, okay, we haven't uh, heard of someone complaining about you no know, wrong questions or no, no extra time. Those kind of complaints have not come from slot number one. But slot number two, definitely the complaint has come up Okay, from, with, from the experts also, from our faculty base also who have given the exam. And the wrong questions were majorly found in the con section and logical reasoning section. Verbal section is also what I've heard from some of the students, but not very clear Okay, about verbal had a wrong question or not. Now, precisely input, output and blood relation questions Okay, were completely wrong. Okay, there were error in these questions. That means you did not have the right option for it. Okay, or rather uh, the, the, in the, the entire flow of logic was not proper so these were some of the concerns okay and that's why people are in chaos okay in mess asking that what is going to happen with their score now okay now this is where i'm telling you about the action that you're supposed to take every year after your cmat exam okay you will have the cmat uh, cmat response sheet that will be out on the cmat official website the link for the website i'm going to give it down uh, under the description okay you can see it there okay click on that link you will see that you will be able to go on the website and log in okay log in using your application number at this point of time if you see okay the response sheet is not out as of now but response sheet will definitely be out in a few days from now once the response sheet is out you'll have two things coming up there okay first that you will see is your own responses okay the, the answer option that you have marked and you will also see the correct answer there okay the correct answer for that particular question okay you will see that so this gives you a very clear picture of your own score that you will be getting in the cmat exam now the point is this that if the questions were wrong okay or if the options were wrong okay in that case cmat website okay is also going to give you that option to raise objection you need to click on that raise objection okay for the incorrect questions you need to the option of raise objections click on that raise objection for the incorrect questions so more people raise the concern okay it is going to be uh, under highlight okay for the cmat authorities so once the issue is found out okay by the authorities and they they think that yes something has gone wrong from their side okay there's a very high chance that you will get a grace marks for it now the question okay the another thing that comes to mind that sir i did not attempt those questions then what happens okay now that is a notification clarification that cmat the authorities should give that if the question was wrong okay are they going to give grace marks only for people who have attempted the question or for people who have left the question okay so ideally okay if you ask me okay if the question is wrong they should directly give those grace marks to everyone in that particular uh, slot okay it's not that they should consider it only for the people who attempted because a lot of people might have not not attempted it thinking that agar hamara wrong chala gaya to humko negative marks milega ye soch ke logon ne attempt bhi nahi kiya hoga so ideally that should happen but as of now you guys should keep this in mind that whenever the response sheet is out okay i'm going to update that on our youtube channel so follow us there uh, follow us here so that you get updates i'm going to update you about the response sheet once the response sheet is out go check each and every particular question of yours okay and raise objections okay that is only the way that you might get your grace marks okay for those truths three five questions that were wrong okay i hope you guys like our content okay please like our video okay and share it with your friends okay in different whatsapp groups so that people are benefited from this they know at least that what they are supposed to do after this mess that has been created by the cmat exam all the best